Hi everyone, welcome to researchmd.com. We got, uh, we're going to do another analysis on a recent study, the effect of jackfruit on chemotherapy induced leukopenia. Again, my name is Pramil Charya. I'm a director of research, uh, internal medicine residency program, transitional residency program director, and I'm also a some professor of medicine. I teach medical students and the medical residents. So let's get into our subject. What is jackfruit? It's a scientific name is Arctocarpus heterophilus, uh, more uh, seen in the uh, uh, southern Asia part. In the edible pulp contains 74% water, 23% carbohydrates, 2% protein, and only 1% fat. It's a good source of dietary fiber. It also, if you have 100 gram portion of raw jock fruit, okay, you got 400, I mean, actually like 95 kilocalories. It has moderate level of vitamin C and potassium and a rich source for vitamin six, well, vitamin B6. So, um, when we talk about, I mean, uh, jackfruit, there is this like uh, unripe jackfruit and the ripe jackfruit. So the, in this study we're talking about, remember, like unripe jackfruit powder. So what is chemotherapy? Chemotherapy, we have a type of cancer treatment, everybody knows, we give, use the chemical to destroy the cancer cells. It works by stopping or slowing the growth of the cancer cells, and, but it, all, it can also cause like a lot of damage to the healthy cells, that's why whatever the cells, when they divide too fast, like the hair, mouth, intestine, that's where the most of the complication, that's why they have uh, oral ulcers, you're going to lose the hair, and then a lot of stomach problem and all that, they usually develop because they're the rapidly divided cells there. So it can also cause many side effects, right? One of the, I mean, it can affect the bone marrow, and leukopenia, uh, there's a white blood cell count drops below 4,000. Everybody know white blood cell is very important to prevent infection, right? If you have low white blood cell count, you know, body can be, I mean, susceptible to infection and they could die. So what, how do they treat the chemotherapy-induced leukopenia? There's this drug called Pecfilgrastrim, okay? Um, that is given to manage the leukopenia. Um, now, role of jackfruit in leukopenia, that's what is going to, how does it work? Um, what is the role? Jackfruit, mainly thing jackfruit contains this, uh, uh, um, this thing called pectin, okay? It increases the survival of the bone marrow cells and the intestinal crypt stem cells and uh, uh, so they decrease leukopenia, okay? And also have like carotenoids, lignine, isoflavones, and saponin. And these are all have like anti-cancer anti pro pro properties. But the main thing I think I would say if I had to take anything out of this slide is the pectin and how does it prevent the leukopenia. Okay, now scientific study, we found this study it was a publication about jackfruit 365 and to look at their effects on the chemotherapy induced leukopenia. The objective of this study is to investigate the effect of jackfruit 365, which is an unripe jackfruit powder, reducing chemotherapy induced leukopenia. So the design of the study, not very strong, retrospective cohort study, and the results are given. In the group treated with, there was two groups. One group was treated with the jackfruit 365, 211 cycles of chemotherapy, no one developed leukopenia. Very significant, right? And the mean number of cycles when leukopenia occurred, mean, and they compared mean whilst of um, the filgrastim taken, it was very less in the people who got jackfruit 365, okay? The strength of the study, again, a novel idea based on the science. They want to check it. Congratulations to the authors. Now, weakness, not a randomized control study, only a retrospective cohort study. It's also like industry sponsored. Jackfruit 365 sponsored the study, okay? Conclusion, unripe jackfruit floor or supplementation is beneficial in decreasing chemotherapy based on this study, okay? Thank you so much for watching and we'll be back with uh, another great study soon. Please subscribe to our channel so we can produce more presentations like this. Thank you.